Hey everybody, how's it going? No, this isn't the Line 6 Spider Review. I've been working my ass off on it though. Um, I hope to have it ready for you on Sunday at noon Eastern Standard Time. That's 9 a.m. Pacific for all my friends out in California. You guys fucking rock. Anyway, I know there's a lot of interest in seeing this review. It's coming. So first up, I've got this little package from Samson Microphones and Korg. A bunch of you guys have been asking about the the Samson uh, 7 mic drum kit. And I thought that's a great idea. Let's uh, let's see if we can get a set and review them and put them through its paces. So I know I'm gonna have TJ out in the next uh, few days. So, oh yeah, there it is, the Samson DK707 drum mic kit. How awesome is that? Thanks very much to Samson for that. Um, really looking forward to, to putting this through its paces because we're going to be doing a couple of videos. I'll be doing a full review on this, of course, but we're also going to be doing something called the $1,500 studio challenge. And that's where we take a budget of $1,500 and see if we can put together a functioning recording studio minus the actual instruments, of course, but it'll be mic preamps. It'll be microphones, uh, software, plugins, all that crap. I want to see if it's possible to do a functioning recording studio for under 1500 bucks and just how good we can get it to sound. But, uh, oh wow, look at this. This is pretty cool. Oh. Nice carrying case. Nice, nice touch there, guys. And let's see, ooh, this is pretty badass. I'll have to see if I can get a cutaway of this. But uh, look at that, wow. It's already got the clips already installed. Are these shock mounts on the condensers? How awesome is that? Very cool. So we've got, uh, yeah, it looks like we've got the Tom mics, kick mic, that's got some heft to it. Nicely done, Samson. And uh, these awesome clip-ons. I used to have a set of these uh, for my old uh, Sennheiser E604. So really looking forward to trying this out. This looks really cool. Of course, if you're subscribed to my channel and if you're a mailing list subscriber, which reminds me, I really need to get, get one of those out today. But um, if you're if you're signed up for both of those, you're automatically entered to win this. So I will be giving it away once we're done with it, along with the Focusrite unit. So make sure you're signed up for my mailing list because I can't wait to give that to some lucky bastard. Okay, next up, I have something really cool. It's Canadian made. This is a high-end four-channel Class A mic preamp from PAU Audio. And they're from Calgary, Alberta. And you know, I always love Canadian Pro Audio stuff. Um, I've been a big fan of Ward Beck for years and years and years. I've had one of their, their um, mixers stashed in my closet for a while. I used that in the early 2000s. It's kind of like the Canadian need. Anyway, um, most of Canadian stuff is built a really high spec. Um, you know, you take a look at the Wilkinson stuff, you take a look at the Rev stuff, it's all really cool. And here, check this bad boy out. Ooh, this has got some heft to it too. This is the PAU Audio Microphone Preamp. It's four inputs and um, direct inputs on the front. It's just class A, real simple mic preamp. Can't wait to try this out on some drums and some guitar, vocals, all the usual uh, suspects. This unit's got a lot of weight because it's all transformer coupled. Um, super, super high end. I think this thing retails for about 2,000 Canadian. So you guys who are looking to get maximum bang for your buck and get some really high-end preamps this would probably be the unit to check out what do i have now Ooh! oh, oh okay awesome that, that turned out nice wow look at this first up we got the ever amazing um artwork by jason rains here the lead guitar players toolkit shirt with the guitar the tiara the mirror and the box of tissues. The big question, of course, is are they sad tissues or happy tissues? Depends on your guitar player, I guess. Anyway, you can get one of these at the spectermedia.ca shop. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> I might just bring these back, um, considering that Donald Trump won. Yeah, make music great again. Uh, because it's as a Canadian sitting here watching America go through that election, it's going to be very interesting to see Donald Trump making America great again for the next four years. Okay. <laughs> and for everybody who just got pissed off at that last comment, I just like to remind you, nobody cares that you're offended. Really. Nobody gives a shit. 
can get each of those uh, shirts in the spectermedia.ca shop. Um, the Make Music Great Again shirt was actually a temporary um, like three-day shirt. I might bring that back. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to get one of those, especially considering uh, Trump won the election. If you guys are interested in those shirts, I'll make those available to you. Let me know. And of course, we've got an anime loot crate. And I'm going to take a look at and see what we got here. You guys check in my video description if you're interested in getting an anime loot crate or a loot crate of any kind, you can get it at um, in my description below. Oh, okay, this actually looks pretty badass. Got a Bleach official licensed product. What in the hell is this? A Bleach watch. Okay, that's kind of cool. And a freaking t-shirt. Not sure who this is because I can't read Japanese, but actually that looks kind of badass. I like the color scheme. Oh, come on, awesome. We got... Uh, one punch, punch Man manga, uh, and um, some Tokyo Goal goodies. Demi Human. Oh, okay. This is kind of this is the Demi Human pack, and of course we get a, a poster, and this explains everything we get. So that's kind of cool. If you guys are into anime or um, they've got horror and sci-fi and whatnot, hit uh, the link in the description below. You can subscribe to Loot Crate and get yourself sent something pretty cool every month. It's kind of neat. Okay, yeah, like I said, just a real quick one today. Thanks very much for watching, everyone. Um, stay tuned. Tomorrow, we've got SMG viewers' comments coming up, of course, with all your best comments and questions from the week. Really looking forward to putting that one out. And, of course, on Sunday, we've got the Line 6 Spider 5 Fearless Gear Review. Just remember, I bought this amp with my own money. Nobody... Nobody paid me off. You guys are going to get an honest, unbiased opinion of what it actually sounds like, not just a bunch of marketing bullshit. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you signed up to my newsletter. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. It goes a very long way in letting me do this for a living. Thanks so much for your support. You guys fucking rule. I'm out of here. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching this episode. If you like the content, please support the channel either at my SMG shop or through my Patreon. If you want to see more, hit one of the playlists. Thanks for watching. I'm out of here.